Didn't Pat mind you taking all that? Oh, I didn't ask. Oh, I live there, but I don't have to talk to her or David, do I? It's not. Right, let's get the shopping in. Yeah, and then you can take me for a drink. Yeah, I'm gonna have to see David. I'll get some more money off of him. It's a pity you have to have anything to do with him. I know, but we need the cash, don't we? He's such a prat. Mm. All right, Becky? What's it to you? Look, this won't do. All of us living under the same roof and not talking to each other. No, yeah, well, it's not my fault, is it? I didn't say it was. I just think it's time we did something about it, right? Yeah, maybe. And how are you? Do you need anything over there? Quite a few things, actually. I'll see what I can do about it, OK? <laughs> Didn't get far with the cleaning, did we? I want to buy your mum a big bunch of flowers. What, a wreath? No, a real one. Because if she weren't such an old cow, you'd still be living at home, right? <laughs> <laughs> Brother. Oh, don't blame me, I didn't ask him to come here. Oh. Front door's open, I thought we'd pop in. I know, for a drink. Where'd you get that? Came his grand left us in the room. Have we come at a bad time? Yeah, you have as it goes. Why aren't you at school anyway? School burned down. Yeah, we set fire to it. <laughs> So the bloke goes, well, I don't know, it was a funny looking thing, but then we shaved it. No, you're prat, this is what happens, right? The first bloke turns around and says, what sort of dog's that, right? Yeah. Then the second bloke turns around and says, I don't know, it was a funny looking thing, but then we shaved his mane off. That's <laughs> really stupid. <laughs> Mind you, your jokes always are. Listen, I've got this new one, right? This no, it. Robbie. And there's cans left. No, you drank them all. Well, if you want something to do, why don't you help us tidy this place up? No way. Anyway, it's my birthday tomorrow. So? No, I get enough of that at home, all right? Robbie, clean your room. Robbie, wipe Sonia's nose. Yeah, where is the old witch? She still ate me. Don't know. <laughs> I mean, she's mad. Why have all us kids and they're eight or so after? Maybe she don't know about birth control. Maybe you should tell her. Yeah, yeah I can just imagine me going up to mum. Hi, mum, do you know what these are? We said just you used them, Mrs Jackson. <laughs> she is weird, though. I mean, she hates me and I don't even know what I've done to deserve it. Yeah, she's just jealous. That's her trouble. Why, because we're young and good-looking? Yeah, and she's a shriveled-up old prune. She just can't stand me being happy, just cos her life's a total mess and all her blokes have been disasters. Now it looks like Alan's on his way out. I mean, it ain't our fault, she just takes it out on me and you. She's an horrible, twisted old cow, if you ask me. Oh, you know what? What? Got to get Robbie's out for his birthday. Well, we can't, can we? That shopping's cleaned us out. Well, we've got to. He'd be upset otherwise. Uh, wait here, I'll be back in a minute. Where are you going? We'll get some more money. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, you like that. Hi, Nat. What's that? Card from your brother's birthday. Oh, yeah, very nice. I don't know how he can listen to this stuff. He's got no taste, that's how. How much money you got left? Oh, plenty. He must be doing all right, then. No, I can't see how, though. I mean, the same cars are still sitting there, unsold. Still, as long as the money keeps coming in, I ain't complaining. Yeah, he's weird, though, and he? he looks at you in a weird way. Are you bad mouthing now? No, I'm just saying that David Witts bloke is a bit weird, isn't he? I'll oh, say, seriously weird. <sighs> I'm tired. Is Kathy leaving you to do all the hard work, is she? Yeah, she's going to sort out her engagement, too. What are you going to wear? Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm going yet. You might have been invited. I'm not sure. Oh, of course you will. Just go and ask. Well, I don't like to. Well, ask Phil, then. I can't. Why not? Well, I just can't, all right? <laughs> I saw a job advertised in the shop. It was one of a special promotion. What do you reckon that means? I don't know. It could mean anything. Probably something like the job Sam had once. Prancing around some shopping mall dressed up as a bit of cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Want my dressing up as a mash trap if I've got enough money for it? Yeah, it didn't anyway. Hello? Sorry, mate. <coughs> All right. Alright. What is that? What's it look like? An anteater? Yeah, no fun to mention it. Oh, I don't know. A bit of Doberman in there, I'd say. Mm -hmm. Oh, mind you, a bit of poodle. I ain't no poodle in them all. He's a well hard dog. He ain't a stupid <laughs> little lap dog. Who's is he? Mine. I found him. Come here. Does he bite? Yeah, of course he does. But it's only one I tell him to. <laughs> Mum's gonna go mad. No, she won't. No, it's mine. It's my birthday present from me to me. The one thing I got today, there wasn't a piece of old crap. Oh, yeah? Happy yeah. birthday. We got you something. Oh, oh wicked. <laughs> oh, yes. Why aren't you at school anyway? You're bunking up. Left. What? Uh, Left, jacked in. Walked out. School's out forever, then. What do you mean? You just left? 
You stupid idiot. What are you going to do now? I don't know. I'll find a job. There ain't no jobs. All right, then, me and Wellow, we'll go busking. You can't sing or play anything. All right, then, well, we'll go up to the old people and say, give us your money or the dog will bite you. Mum's really going to kill you this time. Yeah, it was brilliant. Showed us how to do those computer graphics you see on TV. I wouldn't mind getting into something like that. Yeah, I reckon I might check out the sixth form colleges, see if they got anything like that. Oh, you two, hurry up. I want to go home. What happens to you now, Robs? What happened? You don't want to know. Anyway, in your business, all right? Oh, pardon me for taking an interest in your life. Babe, will you tell him to leave? I want to go home. She wants to go home. Can't always get what you want. Anyway, Kevin, I'm going to have to go to one of those places she was on about. You know, the place for dropouts. Shame. What's he doing here? Got as much right to be here as you. Wrong. It's a dog. Dogs ain't meant to be in calves. Then who let you in? Ah, oh, very funny. Right, you two, just get out, will you? I want to go home. Oh, I ain't finished this. Well, hurry up, then. But it wasn't my fault. Everything just goes wrong for me. <sighs> Wish my mum had a abortion when she was having me. Yeah, she probably doesn't all. I mean, no, mum doesn't want me. School doesn't want me. Yeah, and I don't want you sitting here any longer. Will you just get out? You can't talk to me like that, all right? Yes, I can. Are you going to leave or do I have to call the police to shift you? Go on, Wen. I'll bite her. Bite her. Go on. Oh, get a life, Robbie, eh?